Hi guys, welcome to this video. It's Veronica here and today we are doing our first ever envelope stuffing video. I have been obsessed, obsessed with these videos and I'm so excited to start my own. Um, 2020 was not the best financial year for me and just like for a lot of people out there and I decided that 2021 is going to be a better year for me. So, I decided to use the budget envelope stuffing and I got this cute little binder from Amazon for like $8.99. I'll make sure to link it down below. And I also got these cute little money envelopes from Amazon as well, which I will also link down below, of course. My family has a Cricut, so I put all the different categories onto the envelopes, which you'll see when we go through them. Okay, so the first envelope today we will be doing is spending. So spending was going to get $20, and that's just like if I want to go to Marshall's and buy another candle, or I just hang out with friends or something, something like that. That's what spending is for. The next category is car loan, which is going to be the biggest one for me for this month. And because this is my first ever video, this is more just my whole monthly catch-up type of thing because usually it's going to be $55 a week for my car loan per month but for right now it's going to get $180 okay 20 40 60 80 100 120 140 160 180 and then I have $40 in the bank that I need to go get for it but we're kind of in a snowstorm right now so I'm just going to get that tomorrow and it's not due to the end of this week anyway. Okay, so that is great. The next is car maintenance. And normally it's going to get $30 for insurance and then $5 for maintenance. But I have my title renew coming up this upcoming month because I'm turning 21. So it's going to get $60 right now for that renew just to play catch up and once we get going it's gonna get 35 so, so it's gonna get 20 40 60 62 dollars this week cars are really expensive they're not just like just the loan either so the next one is subscription so i have three subscriptions that i use right now first one is my apple cloud for my phone and that is 9.99 a month and then the second one is my Adobe membership for like Premiere, Photoshop, all of that, which is $32.01 <laughs> for the month. And then I'm also doing a group call right now, which is $100 a month. So that needs $25 a week. We are going to take $3 for the Apple subscription. And then we're going to take $9 for the Adobe. So one, two, three, four five six seven eight nine nine dollars for that and then we are going to take a 25 for my group call and that is going to total 37 dollars let's just make sure 20 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35, 36, 37. And this one is going to stay $37 a week for right now. Let's stick it out in there. Okay, the next one is taxes. So I do a lot of self-employed work slash DoorDash, Instacarting, all of those side hustle type of things. So I always need a lot more taxes, money to pay because they don't take out taxes when you get paid. But I also think it's important to always have a taxes spot no matter what. It's better to be more prepared than underprepared. So this week it's going to get $10 in taxes. Okay, gas isn't going to get any this week because I didn't even use it. And I'm just setting a base because this is my first time ever doing it. 
next week it's going to get $20, so you'll just have to wait for that video. So business, I am going to put $8 into my business, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Um, my business one I use for, I have a lot of donate, domain names that I have bought. I also run a blog, which I will link down below as well. So I need money for that and all of that business stuff. And right now I'm still working on paying off my credit card. I have like $385 to pay off. And once I pay that off, then I'm going to put more money into my savings slash emergency fund. So these two are getting nothing this week, but they will be getting some soon. I also have a school account. I'm a junior in college right now, so I need to save up for school. But before I do that, I'm going to pay off my credit card and keep that at the minimum. And I still use my credit card, so mostly I will pay for all of my like subscriptions and all that using my credit card because I get cash back. But then I'll have the money here to pay it off each month. So... And the last $20 are going to go into my beauty because I am turning 21 soon and I want to get my nails done for my birthday. So that's what this is for. So we have 10, 15, 20. Put that in the back and we'll put that in beauty. And that is it. I also have a food section, but right now I'm kind of using my spending as food because I am living at home because of the pandemic that's going on so I'm not at school so food isn't as high up in my needs right now so yeah those are all of my money for this week I hope you liked the video and I had really fun doing it I love this stuff I'm just excited for 2021 I think it's gonna be great I really hope you enjoyed watching uh, make sure to like and subscribe there's gonna be a ton more of these videos a ton because these were so much fun I hope you have a wonderful day Remember, you are always enough, no matter who you are, where you're at, or what you're doing. You are always enough. Okay, have a great day, guys. Bye.